Hey folks, thanks for joining us. On this week's hunt, we traveled to Florida to chase hogs. I got a couple young friends with me, Tanner Marsh and DJ Clement. They've got their compounds, and this is the very first out-of-state trip they've ever been on. They learned a lot and had some success. What was interesting is when we got home from the hunt, they let me know that they wanted to try traditional bow hunting and ordered themselves some entry-level recurves. So I'll be excited to bring you their adventures in the next couple of months and years as they travel along on their journey. Thanks again for joining us. center. I drew back early because we thought they were coming in from the left and I thought I was going to have a quick shot. But they came in right down the middle and there was a female staring right at us and she was pissed. She definitely knew something was up. But there's still more in the area. There, The pigs are all around us. So we're going to sit tight and watch what happens.
this spot again tomorrow. So we'll see what happens. I'm just gonna set the GoPro up. Maybe something up here, just to get another point of view. Most of the pigs were coming in from the left. I mean, at one point when they came around the second time, you had a couple over here on the right too and behind us and stuff like that. So, but you know, majority of them, there was a big group of them that came in down from the left here. So I'm thinking I'll post up on this tree maybe. That's a good idea. All right, it's about uh, 6.15 a.m. Uh, January 12th, 2024, down here at the 101. This is our third morning. Uh, I'm gonna be recording for DJ this morning for this hunt. I was able to, to get lucky and I killed a pig um, two days ago. So I've just been uh, taking my time enjoying it, filming DJ. Um, this is the spot we were at last night, a ton of activity. So we were kind of waiting to see what the weather looked like, see if it rained. If it rained, we're gonna go to a different enclosed blind, but it looks like it's not gonna rain. So we decided to come back here today and try our luck. Um, yeah, see if we can get after it this morning, get DJ a kill. Rain's become a little too much, so I think we're gonna turn it in for the morning. Yep. Maybe wait for the rain to pass and then get back out here. Because uh DJ's gotta kill a hog today, right? Yeah, rain should pass pretty quickly. I'm not too worried about that. But we got the Taj, might go sit in the Taj. Yeah, big and closed blind, so keep us out of the rain. Off. There you go. Just needed the right tool. Yep. This here, he can adjust to what length he needs it to. Not sure I'm telling you this because he's got to do it. Yeah. I can hear you. I understood. Exciting. Oh, 
shake it. Exciting, huh? Oh, so exciting. Good. He's good. So he went that way. Then he stood right there for a sec. This way. Okay. Let's see if we can find blood the way he went out. So I think it was this way. Oh, yeah. Right there. That's, right That's there. good blood. So he came this way. It's a perfect arrow. First, uh, first kill here down in Florida. First hog. It's my second kill with a bow ever. It's awesome. He didn't go very far. I mean, 30 yards. It's perfect. Isn't it beautiful view? <sighs> and so I drew super slow. I was shaking so bad, and then uh, he took like a little. He took like a right turn. That's when I knew, like, I was I was about to shoot him, and then he took a quartering away step, and it was perfect. Like his sh shoulder blade went up, and it was just a perfect. Oh yeah, you nailed him. Opportunity. You had a heck of a shot. Yeah, it's, it's so like awesome. I was telling you. Yeah. Come up the back of the leg. Uh huh. Like right there. You were an inch off. Okay. <laughs> inch off and perfect. <laughs> that, no, that where you hit was perfect. All right, boys. Let's see if what's the word. When it, the spot you're looking at, the arrow goes to, it feels good. It feels really good. You guys are hooked. Oh, yeah. Got you over to the dark side. <laughs> 